Hey everyone, I'm Logan Dubel with TSTV and we are here on campus asking students about the university's move to ban TikTok on its Wi-Fi network. Some say it's a big deal, others not so much. Here's what they had to say to us. I know other universities have done it, so I kind of understand where they're coming from, but I don't think it's going to impact the student body like that much. Students should be mad about this. I'm enraged. Like, come on now, why? Um, I don't really mind it because I don't have TikTok. We live in the dorms, so we're constantly connected to the Wi-Fi, which is how we use most of our devices. And the fact that we're paying all this money to live here, we can't even use our phones the way we want to use them. Like, I don't know, I think it's dumb. I think that TikTok is harmful for different ways than what they're banning it for. I can see the argument for it with you know, the, the state government being concerned about privacy and data access. Here in UT Austin, you know, you can carry an open carry firearm, and yet you still have TikTok um, being banned. I didn't actually realize how big of a deal it was until I saw it on national news. I want to watch TikTok, which often I do. I just turn my data on and then I use it. If the state of Texas wanted them to do it, I guess they kind of had to. But it's just kind of, it's weird. I don't think they're out for students. I don't think they would do something to like get rid of a social media platform. I think really the main goal is just like making sure that they're protecting student data and like the school's data. People can get around it very easily. I think it was more of a symbolic move. It's kind of helped me like uh, manage my time for studying. Like now I find myself spending less time on my phone. It's giving more money to the cell phone companies because imagine if you don't have unlimited data, then you're like, Mom, Dad, like, I need unlimited data. Then you can watch TikTok however much you want. Not having TikTok has given me a lot of help in my life, and I hope that they ban Twitter and Facebook next. Mm.